The 5 AM Club by Robin Sharma Chapter 3 How to Be a History Maker There are people who accomplish things, and then there are people who make history and become household names. The latter category is comprised of people who set records, break boundaries, and make contributions so significant that they are immortalized through their success. But what's the difference? And what determines the type of success you have? According to our billionaire mentor, a history maker is defined by their four areas of focus. The first is their ability to capitalize on their talents. This doesn't mean that they're the most talented people, but rather that they make the most of what they have. So, instead of comparing your gifts to someone else's and assuming you don't have what it takes, capitalize on the talents you do have and use them to make a difference. The second key area of focus is the ability to free yourself from distractions. This is especially vital because it's probably the number one problem that holds people back. And whether your distraction comes in the form of social media addiction or a toxic relationship that drains you of your energy, neither of these distractions can remain in your life if you want to be a winner. So, to cultivate a winning worldview, it's crucial that you focus, simplify, and concentrate. Start by eliminating multitasking from your life and become a purist instead, devoting your attention only to a few key projects instead of spreading yourself thin between loads of little tasks throughout the day. It's also vital that you eliminate distractions. So take an aggressive spring cleaning approach to the mental clutter of your life. Turn off notifications when it's inhibiting your focus. Cancel activities that don't add joy and value to your life. And most importantly, give yourself a distraction-free hour to jumpstart your day by joining the 5 AM club. Thirdly, it's also important to understand the power of day stacking. Put simply, Day stacking means that accomplishing a few small tasks each day is more important than doing a couple of big things once in a while. So, work on strengthening one small skill or ability a little bit at a time each day. If you want to get on top of your email inbox, cultivate a better daily routine, or improve your performance in a few little areas, this is the perfect way to do it. And last but not least, the final key area of focus for history makers is practicing personal mastery. This concept is based off psychologist Anders Ericsson's theory that a person must invest 2.75 hours of daily practice in a skill before they reach the level of elite mastery. So, if you want to master yourself and truly become capable of orchestrating a successful future, invest the first two hours of each day in working deeply on yourself, your mindset, and your attitude.